Okay, I'm here on Wilbur Road right now, so I'm going to show you the land. So this is the land that we're looking at, and that's belonging to the city there. So you can see the big, it's like a rainwater oh, okay. uh, runoff. Okay. Um, the lot starts on the other side. But this rainwater will still stay here, right? Well, I don't know if the city has plans to do anything about it. I, I'm not sure. So where does the lot start and stop, basically? And this is this side is all belonging to the city, eh? Yes. But is this going to be a, like sewer, or is this going to affect the... It's not sewer. So here's, here's the, the sanitary. Okay, so, so this is the is, sewer here, right? Yeah, that's the sewer there. There's... Um, That's sewer as well. Oh, okay. There's another one over there. So the city has. Um, so there are three sewer spots. some infrastructure. Okay. For development. And what about all these trees and stuff like that? Is that a part of the lot? That no, the lot comes in this way. Okay. Oh, let me show you. Uh, you've got all my stuff that I said. Yeah. Right? So the lot starts from here. So that's all sewer there. There's a lot of inclination here on this. So here's the road up there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we are standing. We are standing. Right. Well, here's the sewer here. Okay. So here's the sewer. So we're standing right here. Okay. And so you can see the lot line. That is on the lot. Oh, that sewer is on the yeah, lot. Yeah. So what about that palm tree? Is that on the lot? No. Okay. It's so right that here. lot, the sewer is there, so we'd have to sort of curve it, and then now you have this here. This is a part of the city. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm looking at this here, and I'll have to confirm that, but looking at this here, mm -hmm. that would say that that is part of it, but I'm told that it is not part of it, so I'll have to... Um, try to understand so 0.75 acres, right? So how deep does the lot go run this side? So the lot goes, I believe that... Is it going right up to the wall there? Or? It's going right up to the street. Oh, that street there, that's yeah, for sure. That's but Wilbur. this side, and this side? This side is about where that fence is. Okay. Yeah. Up to that fence. Yeah. And then this this one butts basically up to that green fence. Okay, that green fence? Yeah. And here's that apartment building right here. Okay, you got the apartment building. Yeah. But what about this? How far does this go? This goes right up to that ending fence? Um, well, it's a straight line. Uh -huh. So it might capture that big tree. Okay. That big tree might, it, the line might be on this side of that big tree. Okay. It might be well, on we're, the, but, we're standing on the lot size here, right? This also? Yes. And all those trees are also included there? Or? Yes. So there's a lot of that inclination. This ha would have to get totaled. We'd have to do a lot of digging, right? To well, flatten it? You can see that one's on the same type of lot. Oh, okay. So, you know... So if they you did look at the way they did that. There, it sits on the same sort of lot. But they did flattening. Obviously, they must have done a lot of the they excavation. Where that is, yeah. But I mean, that sits higher, and then this this has piers with oh, parking it, underneath. Okay. Yeah. And there's easement. That means we'll have to use that only, or can we have this? People That's what come? you you would need to check with the city mm -hmm. to see if there's a way okay. to develop this so you're coming right off of Wilbur. Okay. And not having to use this easement. Oh, okay, okay. So there's a, a 130 foot long, 30 feet wide easement that starts. See the green fence over there? Uh huh. That's East 8. Okay. And so where those two doors are on that fence, uh -huh. it, that easement goes right along the back side of the properties into here. So, but people will have to use that to get in here. Right now. Uh -huh. Yes, and it could be developed that way. Too. Okay. Um, of course, the, the the road would need to be completed. Okay. To the development, 
um, but to, what do you think for spent. digging something getting this totaled so that we can start building just Cost? any yeah any rough no idea no idea no idea um, you know I don't do a lot of these sorts of properties where I have that sort of knowledge just up here mm -hmm. um, I kind of depend on the people looking at it who are usually developers and know a lot more than I do mm -hmm. about that kind of stuff and that wire is that side right so that's not gonna affect those electric wires are there yeah that so. is those are on the other side of the road oh, okay so that's not gonna impact this so there's no wires um, about here you know you have you do have some coming on this side of the road too oh but, yeah just that wire but you're not gonna build right on yeah the road, yeah that's right like because that yeah it's not right on the road yeah so yeah. it's right there are those also 12 units there i think those are 14. 14 units yeah. okay how long ago was that built? Oh, I'm going to guess 60 or 70. Oh, 60, 70. Yeah. And then there's also apartment units there, right? Uh, those are a bunch of single family homes oh, single family that are homes. owned by the same owners. So how it goes right up to that, eh? So there's, there's a lot of this that would be needing to kind of get total. So this also comes under uh, our lot, This all this mud here? Um, or or the, is it getting the, cut the dirt, somewhere? You know, they just... I, I, the last time I was here, those dirt piles weren't here, and I'm not sure. I know that they, they removed a big tree and some trees, but I don't know why that would cause these dirt piles. So I'm not sure. Th these chippings are from removing some trees. You can see all the stumps. Okay. Yeah. But, uh, you know, a city has got some laws about removing trees. Will we have a problem removing these trees? I don't think you'll have any problem removing these trees. Yeah. They're not like oak trees and... I think they're all almond trees or something. This is quite a lot of digging. Oh my God, this is very hilly, right? To, so the lot goes, all this is a part of the lot? Yeah. Um, I believe it's a straight line from that fence there. So I would say this tree is on the other side of the lot line. So from here onwards. You're going right up to that. Yeah. So that in inside there is still the city? Uh, yeah, that wouldn't be part of the lot. So, I don't know. I, I'm thinking maybe the city is doing something here. This this was not here the last time I was here, so I'll need to check to see what that's all about. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this might be a open, waking place here. Mm -hmm. This is just an open... Uh, open place by the city here maybe we can ask the city if we can include it here or something yeah sure i mean it doesn't hurt to ask anything you know because what's the city gonna do if we start building here right yeah um a lot of palm trees and but because that's wet land, that will not be buildable, just in case the city does. Maybe you can do a park out there or do some improvement. Mm -hmm. Does it go inside to the walk there in the corner? Right in the corner there? Um, I don't know. I didn't walk that way. I know it goes quite a ways if you look on um, you know, Google Earth. It goes quite yeah. a ways that way. Also, there, there's the, that's also multifamily, it looks like. In the blue there at the back, right? I think those are still single-family homes. Are they? Okay. Yeah. Okay, this is the overall view. It's a, a huge slope. We would have to see, do some digging, how we can flatten this, how much money and time it will take to flatten this place. here we'll go inside and look at the sewers yeah there's there's quite a bit of uh, uh, maybe walkway or something it's all belonging to the city eh? if we were to clean this all up I guess maybe the city might give give it for cheaper or something maybe yeah certainly doesn't hurt to ask the city 
So right here is a lot of that sewer stuff which belongs to the city and this is the lot here coming straight down from top there and this from this on this side is all city here but from here from that fence right up to that car you see and right up to that green fence is this whole 32,000 square feet lot Wilbur Avenue in uh, Antioch so this is the kind of land that you can build and it's zoned for what multifamily yeah. R yep. R3 no, not uh, RM20, right? Yes. High residential, high density yeah. residential, right? Yeah. Because it's close to the BART. Right. Okay. Sounds good. Signing off. Reboot construction.